Cabins are alright, eh? Yeah, not bad, I guess, see? It's pretty... This will do in a pinch. This, this, uh... I guess I'll take this for 10 days. Yeah, man. I just can't believe we're here. Hey? Oh, hey. This will be the first time in one of these units. Oh, you haven't been in a cup before? No. Seat belt on. Okay. We made her. We're on top of the world, hey Brant? Oh yeah, buddy. It's all uphill and downhill from here. <laughs> <laughs> right on. That was freaking awesome. What a plane ride. We're on top of the world here. Essentially just found a hammer. She's day nine, down to the wire. We've been hiking like a mother. You know, this brat has put us through the ringer. <laughs> In all seriousness though, like uh, it's like hour two and there's 16 rams across quite a long ways and we got two really nice rams here. So. Just gonna get uh, camp set up for the night. We got them two rams just behind us there. Um, get a better look at him in the morning. And then uh, I'm pretty sure he's an old ram. I'm almost 100% sure he's an old ram. He'll meet the age requirement, but there's 16 more rams, one range over. So I think we'll look at him in the morning then go up and bypass him, go around and try and get a better look at the other ones. So it's only day one, so it's off to a damn good start. Well, we just woke up here. I uh, got some rain overnight, and uh, now it is socked in pretty hard. So, I'm just gonna hang out and hopefully things blow over. And yeah, Brad checked the weather forecast for the next few days, and it's just gonna be cold, and wet. Well, visibility is still zero. Well, we just spent 19 hours in the tent. Well, day three, we're packing up camp. She's still socked in like a bugger. Rainy, and the weather forecast is getting worse. So we're just gonna go down low and camp by a river, hopefully get moved whenever the weather breaks. But yeah, she's been, what, like 36 hours in the tent now, Randall? No, I think we're 48 and change now. Okay, well you lose track of time when you're in a tent <laughs> with your best buddy. <laughs> yeah, I think we're over 48 now. Yeah. Not what I envisioned, but hey, this is the cards we're being dealt, so. Oh, well, we're just making our way down to the airstrip. Got a couple more K to go. The weather's a lot better down here, so. Hopefully we can get picked up and moved, but uh, just have to see.
it's the evening of day four. The weather finally broke, so we uh, just got done supper, gonna head for bed and wake up early in the morning and head up the valley. So got two good days of weather coming up potentially, so hopefully we can find a big old ram. Put on the miles today. Seen about 15 rams or so, lots of using lambs. Um, we found camp for tonight at a pretty cool spot. Nice waterfall in the back there and potential of rams coming over. So if the weather holds, we'll have another big day tomorrow. Give us a lowdown, Adrian. How, how, how's things going? The nature is beautiful. <laughs> Brant's new nature, or nature hikes with Randy and Dutch. <laughs> no, it's good. Freaking awesome country. We made her just about to the top. A couple of caribou up here. Just small bulls and cows. But we, we were, Way around that corner, came down this edge, up the creek bottom, and now we're just about to the top. Bombs away. That's, that's cool, eh? Yeah. Especially because I don't have to get any more of that granola and blueberry shit. <laughs> I hope that's all they packed for you. <laughs> <laughs> I love you too, buddy. What's that? I'm pretty sure I smell some goodies in there. Oh yeah? That or I just smell civilization because I miss it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Food oh drop, goodness. pizza. Oh, Adam, you're the best. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> This is like oh, the best day of my life. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> this is right. <laughs> we have walked a lot of miles for this pizza. Well, it's about 11 o'clock here. We just spent, uh, spotted a band of rams here probably about an hour and a half ago. Uh, we just got to go over that ridge up there. And they should be just over there, so... Crossing our fingers that they're still there. There's another one. 
get them rams from last night. Or just, uh, they moved into a spot where you can get closer. One's a decent ram, just want to get a better look. Just gotta climb this. And, uh, should be able to have a look-see. Smoked him, buddy. Smoked him. <laughs> Dead ram. <laughs> <laughs> That's a beautiful shoe. Fuck, he's awesome. <laughs> he grew. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. <laughs> Shitload of miles, man. <laughs> we worked for that ram. You guys. Uh, thanks, Randy. Fuck yeah, buddy. Tagging along, bro. Grant, you're the freaking man. <laughs> no, you guys are like, savages. It was like hunting <laughs> brother from another mother. Hell yeah. And we just killed a beautiful freaking doll sheep. He's large. <laughs> Look at them old chompers. Yeah, that's so awesome. He doesn't have many left. camp really late last night and uh, had a bit of a sleep and woke up to pouring rain so pouring rain all day sat in the tent and uh, Brant got the caping done on my sheep the face turned and everything done and now it's about 10 o'clock in the evening and we're just heading up to where the airstrip is <laughs> little midnight run to get to the landing strip for the morning a little further than we totted <laughs> <laughs> and we come up the wrong spot. <laughs> yeah. And we seen lots of caribou, which kind of delayed things. Yeah. That's sweet though. Yeah. That's, yeah, it's, I think just after midnight. Got another mile, country mile. 
gotta go up that which looks way way steeper than in this camera but yeah it's got a poke yet before we get to the landing strip living the dream waiting for the airplane to pick us up day 10 hell of a hunt What is this going on here? You're listening to my bullshit. <laughs> <laughs>